Okay, friends, let's play a game here. Here's what I need to know. That's right, Rita, it's a game. It's a fun, super fun game, okay? I wanna know, who snores at night? I don't even know. <laughs> I don't even know what I just walked into. <laughs> right there. <laughs> I want to know who snores at night. Oh, Bucky's just pointed to you. Stormy snores? Oh, and Rita snores? Oh my goodness. Now, Voodoo's not here, so we can't point fingers at him. Did you just sigh like you just got called out? You did? Oh, <laughs> Rita wants to tell something about Buggies, but Buggies does not want her anybody to say anything. So that makes me actually believe that he's the guy who snores the loudest here in the barn. Mm-hmm. Okay. Next up. Who, who smells the worst? Oh, <laughs> Buggies, you don't want them to tell all of your secrets. This is so sweet. Storm, does Bucky smell the worst? He has the worst horsey smell? Oh, she says yes, actually. Okay, next up. Okay, this question is for you, Bucky's. Which one of the girls, which one of the girls has the prettiest neigh? Who has it? Is it Rita? Is it Stormy? The Stormy? Oh, he thinks that you have the prettiest nay. He didn't want to tell you. You're too shy. That's the cutest thing, Bucky. It is. Oh, <laughs> Stormy, he thinks you have a pretty nay. Can we hear you nay nay? <laughs> Okay, next question. This one's for Rita. Rita. Who's nicer to you? Stormy or Bucky's? Oh, I think it's Bucky's. No, no. Stormy? You think so? She doesn't want to answer that either. Oh my goodness. Rita. Okay. Don't you? Oh, Stormy didn't even want to talk about it. She just ran off. She's like, I'll show you nice. I'll show you nice. And then you're up here looking for love in all the wrong places. She just left us both. She didn't want to play our game anymore. She's like, there's no snacks. I'm just, I don't like games. But Rita will, Rita will play for love, huh? Will you play for love? Yes. You gonna stomp for me? Yes, okay. I like how Bucky's is willing. Oh, <laughs> I'm gonna move out of the way here. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna play a little bit smarter. Okay, let's play a smarter game. I guess that Stormy got hungry. At the end of the day, Stormy got hungry. I'm over here, Bucky's. I'm on your bad side, don't forget, okay? I guess my, my Q&A isn't fun when it's about the people right next to you. I'll remember that for next time, Rita. I'll definitely take a good note. Bucky's you and Voodoo play a better guessing game anyway. Let's just be honest here. You do. You guys are way more talkative and comfortable with sharing your answers. You've been around long enough that you know. I understand that. It takes time to earn that trust, huh? You know, Rita's only been here a couple months. Stormy's been here a month. Hi, Beverly. Hi, sweet girl. Beverly wants some love too, okay? We're going to give Bev some love. Now, the donkeys probably would play that game with me and answer all the things that I wanted to know. But it's kind of the middle of the day and everybody's feeling a little bit lazy, to be honest. Right, Bevy? Oh, Beverly is not going to allow me to touch any other donkeys right now. This is the thing. She's going to block me from pretty much everyone at this point and demand love. And that's okay. That's totally okay. I just wanted to play. Oh, boy. 
tell me about it. Tell me all about it. Bucky's wants to go in there with the girl so bad. Oh, Daddy Lester just showed up with treats. Oh boy, we heard her neigh. It is pretty. She's a pretty neigher. She's a pretty neigher. You were right, sir. Oh, your hair looks so pretty. I wish my hair was this color. I do. Oh. <laughs> the whole gang is so starved, aren't you? Let's go talk to Voodoo a bit, okay? Way to go, Dad. Everybody's hungry. Andy, do you want to play the question game? No, she's like, absolutely not. I'm not answering any questions about my friends. So it's just you then. You're the last one that I can ask anything to that's going to tell me the most promising truth. Oh, and Rita. And my Rita. So, who snores the loudest at night? <laughs> Why'd you put your ears back when I asked that question? Is it Nate? I wasn't even thinking of Nate. I was talking about the horses. Who does it? Is it you, sir? Oh, it's Bucky's. Oh, it's Indy. That's who you're going to... It is Indy. That's who you're going to point to right now? I don't blame you. What about you, Ivy? Oh, Rita. Oh, my little senior Rita. Ivy. Does Donkey Dan snore at night? He does. Just a little bit. You don't want to throw your friends under the bus like that? I understand. You're just a lover. You're just a lover. These two are something else today. But you, sir. We know that you're the most gentlemanly gentleman. And that you... You subtly tell us all the truths. Yet you don't want to hurt anyone's feelings or anything like that. I respect that fully. You being a good girl, Ivy. No. Nate! Tell me who snores in Cornholio! Cornholio and Nate. This video was about horses and donkeys and a donkey poodle. It wasn't about roosters and turkeys because I don't even think either of y'all snore. I don't even know if you have the capability to snore. I was not trying to make a video about that. Not about y'all. But jeesh. What's on your lip? You got hay over here or you got a scratch? You got a little bobo. Got a little tiny bobo right there. Did you scratch it on some hay? Yeah. We're going to put everybody in the stalls here in a minute. And everybody's going to get a good brush down. Oh. Oh, you heard the gate. You heard dad in the gate because he's opening it up for everybody to go in. You ready to go? I don't even know. <laughs> I don't even know what I just walked into. <laughs> right there. That hurt.